They are made out of meat. 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 They are made out of meat. Our meat. There is no doubt about it. That's impossible. Sansara, we picked several from different parts of the planet, put them aboard our recon vessels. Sansara, we probed them all the way through, and they are completely meat. Hmm. What about the radio signals? The message is to the stars. They use the radio waves to talk, but the signals don't come from them. The signals come from the machines. So who made the machines? They made the machines. That's who we want to contact. Fansara, meat made the machines. That's ridiculous. How can meat make a machine? Sansara, I am not asking you. I am telling you. These creatures are the only sentient race in the sector, and they are made out of meat. Ralkop? Sansara. Are you asking me to believe in sentient meat? They are made out of meat. <laughs> hmm. Maybe they are like the Ophele. No, Sansara. You know, a carbon-based intelligence that goes through a meat stage. No, Sansara. They are born meat, they die meat. Ralkop, Sansara, stand at ease. <sighs> Spare me. Okay, Sansara. We studied them for almost uh, several of their years, we didn't, which didn't necessarily take us too long. Okay, Sansara. Do you have any idea the lifespan of meat? Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Maybe they are only part meat. No. Like Sansara. the Wheatley. No, Sansara. You know, a, a, a meat head that has an electron plasma brain inside. Sansara, we have thought of that since they do have heads like the Wheatleys. But I told you, we probed them and they are meat all the way through. Hmm? Yes. No brain. Well, there's brain, all right? It's just that the brain is made out of meat. So what does the thinking? Hey, you are not understanding, are you? <laughs> thinking meat? Yes, thinking meat. Hmm. So you want me to believe in thinking meat? Yes, Sansara, thinking meat. The brain does the thinking, the meat. Oh, me God. Conscious meat, loving meat, dreaming meat. You are serious then? Sansara, the meat is the whole thing. Are you getting the picture now? They are made out of meat. Finally, yes. And they've been trying to get in contact with us for almost seven and hundred of their years. Ralkop? Sansara. What does the meat have in mind? Uh, firstly, it wants to talk to us. Ah. Mm. So we're supposed to talk to meat? Yes. Yeah. Uh, Sansara. <laughs> I think it wants to explore the universe, you know, uh, swap information, you know, uh, the usual. So we're supposed to talk to meat. 
That is the idea. That is the message they are sending out by the radio. Over, over. Huh? Anyone there? Roger, over. Anyone home? That sort of a thing. So they do speak then? Yes. They use words? Yes. Concepts and Sarah. Ideas. Except they are doing it with meat. Oh, wait. I thought you just told me that they use radio. Oh, Sansara, what do you think is in the radio? Meat sounds. Oh, my God. Yes, Sansara, you know how, how, how when you... Uh, when you flap and slap the meat, it, it makes a noise. Huh? Yeah, so, so they talk by flapping and slapping the meat at each other. Hey, Sansara, they can also sing by squirting uh, the air through their meat. Singing meat. Singing meat. But you said it yourself. Yeah. Huh? Yes. Yeah, no. <laughs> Who wants to meet meat? Who wants to meet meat? <laughs> this is altogether too much. Yes. What do you advise? Um, officially or unofficial? Both. All right. Officially, we are required uh, to contact, lock in any and all sentient or multi beans into the contract, uh, the quadrant, without any prejudice, any fear, or any. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know that. Uh, Unofficially? Sansara, unofficially, I suggest that we erase all the records and forget about the whole thing. Mm. I was hoping you'd say that. Yeah. It is harsh, but, you know, there are limits. I agree <laughs> with you. Yes. 100%. Aha! Hmm. Case closed, Sansara. Tell me. Sansara, wait. Do we really want to make contact with meat? Hmm. Uh, how many planets are we talking? How many planets are we dealing with here? Huh? How many planets are we dealing with here? Uh, just one. <laughs> uh, yeah. So we pretend that there's no one home in the universe. No, Sansara. These creatures can travel from one planet to another using uh, special meat containers. <laughs> yes, and them being meat, Sansara, they can also travel through sea space, which limits them to the uh, speed of flight and making their possibilities of their contact uh, very pretty slim. You know, infinitesimal, in fact. That's it. Cruel. Yeah? Cruel. Mm -hmm. But you said it yourself. Mm -hmm. Who wants to meet meat? Who wants to meet meat? But what about those who have been aboard our vessels? Mm -hmm. The ones that you have probed. Are you sure they won't remember? They will not remember, Sansara. They will be considered crackpots if they do. I mean, we went into their heads and smoothed out their meat so we can only remain meat's dream. A meat to dream. Mm hmm. <laughs> That's strangely appropriate that we should be midstream. Yeah. And we can mark this sector unoccupied. Agreed. Yeah. Case closed. Case closed. Officially and unofficial. Any other? Huh? Anyone interesting on the other side of the galaxy? Uh, yeah, a rather shy but sweet uh, cluster called Hydrogen Intelligence in a class 9 G445 zone uh, was in contact two galactic rotations ago. Sansara, it wants to be friendly again. Uh, they mm. always come around. Yeah. Mm. You know, I can imagine how how unbearably, how unutterably cold the universe would be if one were all alone. Ralph, mm. mm. Sansara, Masimuso, hey. Chica, Rosa, Wella, Wella, Inya, Minya, 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 Minya,